This episode is brought to you by Domain.com. So by now I imagine you've seen this fantastic drop test from Motorola. But us geeks want to know exactly how you did that. Just last week, Verizon took the wraps off the brand new Motorola Droid Turbo 2 and the Motorola Droid Max 2. While the latter is covered in strong panel of Gorilla 3 glass, the former, which is the higher end of the two, sports what Motorola is calling its new Shatter Shield technology. Well, what does that mean? The company walks us through just what makes their Turbo 2's display. Motorola claims the Turbo 2's display consists of an integrated system of five layers that are designed to absorb shock and never shatter. Supposedly, three years in the making, Moto Shatter Shield consists of specifically these five layers. The first is a rigid aluminum core that provides structural integrity and durability. On top of that, they've added an AMOLED flexible display. Using a flexible display absorbs shock and makes it possible to flex during a drop versus breaking like most screens. Third is a dual touch layer with redundancy that was created to help survive accidents. The fourth layer is the interior lens, which provides a clear protective shield that won't crack or shatter. And lastly is an exterior lens that Motorola claims is a unique hard coat that helps protect the display against normal wear and tear. And they're not kidding. Check out CNN's torture test. Not only did they drop the phone numerous times on concrete and gravel, they also ran over the phone, screen up with a bicycle and a horse's hoof. The phone screen actually dented before it shattered or cracked. Crazy. Having a phone with a shatterproof screen may be great for some. But how great is the screen when you're not dropping it? The Droid Turbo 2 has a big 5.4 inch Quad HD AMOLED display. But because there are so many layers between the display and the glass, the display won't be able to shine as much light through all of those layers. Now according to Ars Technica, there is some visible space between the clear front panel and the display, which results in a device that isn't as bright or as clear as some other smartphones with higher end displays. It's a gray, muddy mess, says Ars Ron Amadio. And that's a good point. I sure would have loved to have this tech on my phone before I smashed it, but at what point does that shatterproof technology become too much of a hindrance and it sort of looks like you're looking through pop bottle lenses? It's a give and take, maybe. Can't wait to get my hands on one. What do you guys think? How important would shatterproof technology be to you on your phone? So do you guys remember from like 15 years ago when people were making money hands over fist in the dot-com bubble? Remember we didn't call it a dot-net bubble or dot-org bubble? We didn't call them dot-biz billionaires, we called them dot-com billionaires. Because that's the power of a dot-com. Now why is that? Because no domain name extension tells your story with the same degree of trust as a .com or .net domain name. .com and .net domain name extensions inject credibility into your online presence. Save 15% on domain names and web hosting when you use our coupon code ANDROID at domain.com checkout. When you think domain names, think domain.com. Thanks for watching guys. My name is Jace. Love to connect with you right here on Google Plus or Twitter. You also don't want to forget about my brothers and sister in Android who are working super hard to be your source for all things. Android.